What's up everyone, welcome back. Jordan Steffen here. Uh, quick little video today about upgrading RAM 2017 iMac. All right, so when I got this uh, iMac, um, pretty much maxed out all the configurable settings except for the RAM. So RAM, in the iMac at least, is one of the last things that Apple is probably ever gonna let you upgrade. Um, with the new iMac Pro coming out, um, they don't even let you do that. So, I thought I'd take advantage of that. Um, just go with the minimum RAM because Apple charges about double what RAM is on the, uh, the aftermarket. So, I went ahead and picked up um, 32 gigs of RAM from Otherworld Computing. There's eight gigs in here already. Gonna pop this in there and um, see what 40 gigs feels like for some, you know, video editing, music production, stuff like that. Um, so, uh, let's take a look at how we do that. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and shut this down and we will uh, get to popping that random. All right, so you're gonna wanna find a nice, soft, flat surface, lay the computer down, screen down. All right, so I think the upgrade's pretty simple. So this little button right here um, next to the, the power the power cable goes, you push that, use a headphone. Ah, there we go. So this little door pops off. All right. And this has some instructions. Basically take these levers, pop them to the side. This whole thing comes up like that. It's pretty smooth. Um, and you've got um, four different memory base here so um, you notice that um, from the top the top one is empty second one has a four gigabyte module the next one's empty next one's got a four gigabyte uh, you want to install RAM in matching pairs pushing straight down until it's firmly seated and then I'll do the same thing with the next and so you're matching um, memory size modules in um, alternating slots. Just like that. And the cover just pops right back on there, I believe. There we go. All right, let's plug it in, see if it all works. See if it boots up. All right, I'm gonna go to about this Mac. Memory, 40 gigabytes. Right, there we go, we've got two four gigabyte um, sticks and two 16 gigabytes for a total of 40 gigabytes of RAM. So, um, I don't know. Guess I'll have to wait and see um, when I edit this video that you're watching right here if, you know, performance is improved. Uh, really nice, easy upgrade to do um, if you have an iMac, you know, one of the only upgrades Apple lets you do these days. So um, definitely take advantage of that. Uh, I can upgrade to a full 64 gigabytes for uh, $600. Apple on the website when you're doing the build to, to order configuration, won $1,400 for that same 64 gigabytes. So um, definitely much more affordable to do it this way. Um, and something that I'll, I'll probably do down the road. But, you know, for now, I think 40 is much better than eight. So we'll see how I get on with the, uh, the new RAM upgrade. All right, so I'm just playing around here in Final Cut. Just doing, you know, starting an edit here. All right, so, you know, so far, um, What's up, everyone? Welcome back. everything Welcome feels back very uh, snappy. Quickly. Not that it didn't before, but, um, I don't know, the true test will be once I've got you know, multiple layers and audio effects and color correction on every, every clip. But um, yeah, um, definitely a uh, worthwhile upgrade, um, especially if you've only got eight gigabytes and you're doing any sort of creative work like video editing, photo editing, it's gonna make a huge difference. Thanks for watching everyone. Um, tune in soon for more you know, tech reviews, kind of how-to videos and uh, the like. Thanks for watching, bye.